It's fantastic to be part of the 10th Merchant City Festival. Of course, the focus is on dance, street theatre, art, culture. And here in George Square, our focus is very much on sport. We're celebrating the fact that it's three years to go until the opening ceremony of the 2014 Commonwealth Games. And we've got all 17 Commonwealth Games sports represented here around the city chamber. The weather has just brought out the crowds and it's been a wonderful atmosphere. The thing about the festival is just the buzz about the place, just sheer joy. Oh, I think it's great. It's really wonderful to see a city celebrating itself and I think it provides a reason for people to take pride in the city. We're having a great time. Yeah, we, fabulous. We've been enjoying browsing the stalls. Um, we're seeing it's like interrailing without having to buy the ticket. <laughs> it's actually very good. I'm enjoying all the food and everything. So it's fantastic. It's just lovely just walking around and seeing all the you know international markets and everything. It's the whole thing's gorgeous. I think it's fantastic. It's yeah. very vibrant and glowing. We're just at a fashion show there. People don't have to pay any money to see some some nice stuff and yeah, no, I think it's lovely and I get to come to a sunny Glasgow. And there's been some fantastic things all around the place. There was a really strange man on stilts um, who was dressed in pink and had knobbly bits and things, which kind of freaked me out a wee bit, but it was really good fun. Yeah, it's been brilliant. We went into the Festival of Fudge, and then we went, we saw Pimp My Caravan down in King Street, and it was ongoing, still ongoing, I think. Um, I park up here every summer with my caravan, whether they like it or not, and have my summer holiday here. That being a 50s kind of guy, I was wondering if I was getting a little bit out of touch with the youngsters. So they're into this kind of hippity hopty music and, and graffiti style, and I'm giving them completely free reign. So by the end of the day, it's going to be transformed into a really um, groovy, modern caravan, and I think I'm going to cut quite a dash on the motorway back down south. Don't you? It's our favourite, really. The, the catering is wonderful, and the, and the production staff are brilliant, and... Um, you know, it's a hot day and we've got lots of um, uh, people coming to watch the show, so it doesn't get any better than that, really. Uh, I've been busking, uh, I've been playing guitar and playing road songs and uh, fire juggling. I've been commissioned to make a large-scale, site-specific piece inspired by the Olympics and the Commonwealth Games called Get Set Glasgow. got loads of different things happening, music, theatre, dance, comedy, it brings lots of people together. It's all free as well, which is great, so it means that anyone can get involved. And there's loads of activities for kids and for adults and stuff like that. So, yeah, it's pretty diverse, it's good. So moving forward to 2014 and obviously the cultural festival is part of that as well so it just highlights us as a major player in festivals and events throughout Europe. <laughs> 